it's pretty fairly easy. I know anybody can do this. Just go around in circles. I'm gonna make them a little bit bigger. Just kind of keep feeling some of the empty space in between them. I'm make it a little bit bigger. Again, you notice I'm not really staying in a particular line or anything like that. Just kind of going real big, a lot of looseness. Now, when you're doing a paint like this, you can do any flower that you want. I would say practice doing different flowers, but here, I just know this is a, a lot easier because it's just using a circle of motion. It's kind of represent the flower. I mean, excuse me, it represents the uh, rose. Of course, we know a rose is not, doesn't look exactly like this, but this just kind of gives a suggestion of sort of like a rose or a circular uh, flower. And here, I'm just adding some white, some light pink, just to kind of give it the flower a little bit more depth. Tip of my brush, just going over certain parts of the flower, just to kind of give it that 3D look a little bit. <clears throat> 